today i am discussing with you about the problems on non exact differential equation i am taking one problem and how to solve that problem and for this problem which method is suitable okay first the problem is solve y square dx plus x square minus xy minus y square into dy is equal to 0 here the given problem is comparing with the general form that is m dx plus n dy is equal to 0 here dx coefficient is m dy coefficient is n okay here what is m here m is equal to y square n is equal to x square minus xy minus y square here first we check the condition of exact what is the condition dou m by dou y is equal to dou n by dou x the equation one is exact if that condition is not satisfies it is non-exact okay first m function is differentiating with respect to y dou m by dou y is equal to y square differentiation is 2y n function is differentiating with respect to x here x square differentiation is 2x xy differentiation means y is a constant x differentiation is 1 y square differentiation is 0 it is equal to 2x minus y this is 2y here clearly these two are not equal that is nothing but dou m by dou y is not equal to dou n by dou x so equation 1 is the given equation given problem is equation 1 that equation 1 is non-exact here clearly the given problem is non-exact we follow the methods 5 which method is suitable for this problem first the given problem is in homogeneous that is the first condition check it here dx coefficient is y square here y power is 2 dy coefficient is n function that is the n function of x and y variables here x coef x square means x power is 2 here x second term of the n is x power 1 y power 1 that is nothing but the sum is 2 here y square is nothing but this is also 2 See here in the problem the each and every term is in second degree of the variable x and y so here all variables power is same so it is the homogeneous equation if the given equation is homogeneous we go for the second method that is in that the integrating factor is 1 by mx plus ny okay here here equation 1 is a non exact equation a non exact differential equation and it is <coughs> homogeneous differential equations if it is homogeneous means in this in this an integrating factor is equal to 1 by mx plus ny. Here find out mx plus ny. What is the m function? y square is m. y square into x plus n is x square minus xy minus y square into y. It is equal to x y square x square y into y is x square y minus x y into y x y square minus y cube. Here plus x y square minus x y square get cancelled. It is equal to 
x square y minus y cube. In these two terms, taking common y, the remaining terms are x square minus y square. Here, integrating factor is equal to 1 by mx plus ny. It is equal to 1 by y into x square minus y square. This is an integrating factor. Now, the equation 1 is multiplying with an integrating factor. Equation 1 is multiplying with an integrating factor. Here, integrating factor is 1 by y into x square minus y square into equation 1 is y square dx plus x square minus xy minus y square dy is equal to 0. Here separate y square by y into x square minus y square into dx plus x square minus xy minus y square by y into x square minus y square into dy is equal to 0. Here 1y, 1y get cancelled. It is y by x square minus y square into dx plus write these two terms side by side. It is side by, it is the last term, this minus xy and this denominator is separate for first two terms and the last term that is x square minus y square by y into x square minus y square minus xy by y into x square minus y square into dy is equal to 0. Here y by x square minus y square into dx in this x square minus y square x square minus y square get cancelled plus 1 by y minus this y this y cancelled x by x square minus y square into dy is equal to 0. Here the equation 2 is exactly an exact differential equation. But again we can check is it exact or not. Okay. Here the equation 2 is comparing with the general form of the first order first degree differential equation in that what is this equation 2 is comparing with m1 dx plus n1 dy is equal to 0. Here m1 is equal to y by x square minus y square n1 is equal to 1 by y minus x by x square minus y square. Here we can check is it exact or not. That is m1 function is differentiating with respect to what? Here u by v form v into dou u by dou x that is y derivative is 1 minus y into x is a constant 0 minus 2y by x square minus y square whole square. It is equal to x square minus y square. Here first term is 0 minus into minus plus 2y square by x square minus y square whole square. Here minus y square plus 2y square it is x square plus y square by x square minus y square whole square. It is the dou m1 by dou y. Dou m1 by 
दो वाई दिस इज एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस वाई स्क्वायर बाय एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस वाई स्क्वायर होल स्क्वायर नेक्स्ट दो एन वन बाय दो एक्स हियर द फर्स्ट टर्म इज इन वाई फंक्शन इट्स डेरिवेटिव इज जीरो इट इज अगेन यू बाय वी फॉर्म हियर डिनोमिनेटर इज माइनस एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस वाई स्क्वायर इनटू एक्स डेरिवेटिव इज वन माइनस एक्स इनटू एक्स स्क्वायर डेरिवेटिव इज टू एक्स वाई स्क्वायर डेरिवेटिव इज जीरो बाय एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस वाई स्क्वायर होल स्क्वायर हियर डो एन वन बाय डो एक्स इज इक्वल टू एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस वाई स्क्वायर माइनस इज आउटसाइड माइनस एक्स इनटू टू एक्स इज माइनस टू एक्स स्क्वायर बाय एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस y square whole square it is do n1 by do x is equal to multi x square minus 2x square it's minus x square minus y square by x square minus y square whole square here in the numerator two terms having the negative so taking common negative negative into negative positive it's x square plus y square by x square minus y square whole square so that is here do n1 by do x is equal to x square plus y square by x square minus y square whole square it is a do n1 by do x Here, do m one by do y and do n one by do x both are same. So it is clearly an exact differential equation. Do m one by do y is equal to do n one by do x. So equation one is equation two is. an exact differential equation it is an exact differential equation means we can solve the equation 2 by the method of exact general solution what is the general solution of exact differential equation integral integral over x m1 dx plus integral only y terms n1 dy is equal to constant here x y treating as constant in the first one this is the is the general solution of exact differential equation okay here what is m1 m1 is equal to y by x square minus y square n1 is equal to 1 by y minus x by x square minus y square these two are functions substitute in the general form that is integral over x means y treating as a constant y by x square minus y square into dx plus integral only y terms means this is the only y term select that one 1 by y dy is equal to c here y is a constant right outside integral 1 by x square minus y square into dx plus 1 by y dy is log y equal to c here we know the formula integral of 1 by x square minus a square dx is 1 by 2a log of x minus a by x plus a 
pick this is the formula applying that in the place of y square a square is there that is y into 1 by 2y log of x minus y by x plus y plus log y is equal to c here y y get cancelled log of x minus y by x plus y this 1 by 2 is taking as power so whole power 1 by 2 plus log y equal to c here log a plus log b equal to log ab log of x minus y by x plus y whole power 1 by 2 into y equal to c eliminate the log that is x minus y by x plus y whole power 1 by 2 into y equal to e power c it is nothing but one arbitrary constant c1 now squaring on both sides that is eliminating 1 by root 2 that is x minus y whole square into whole square into 1 by 2 y square by x plus y equal to e power c whole square that is nothing but c square or c c1 square or this is equal to c it is nothing but x minus y here 2 to get cancelled by x plus y into y square is equal to c so what is the general solution the general solution of equation 2 or indirectly the general solution of equation 1 is x minus y into y square is equal to c into x plus y it is the general solution of equation 1 therefore the required solution of equation 1 is x minus y into y square is equal to c square into x plus y or c into x plus y whatever that's arbitrary constants power square is nothing but is also that is also one more arbitrary constant let it be c or c square whatever it may be. but the main thing is the variables power is same here x minus y into y square is equal to c square into x plus y it is the required general solution of the given equation if the equation is in homogeneous and non-exact we can choose an integrating factor is 1 by mx plus ny okay